these glasses are going to be greasy no matter what. Uh, thank you for your condolences, by the way. She should be out of quarantine on Monday. It's the whole weekend wasted. Ah. Yeah, I noted that um, you had some potential plans going. Yeah. I mean, um, what's the saying? When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. So, make alternative plans um, inside, I guess. There's not much you can do, though, when they're sick with COVID. Um, but, you know, video games are pretty high up on the list, I think. Maybe comfort food. Have some comfort food ready for everyone. You beat Doom. Nice. Oh, um, the more recent one by Bethesda, right? That's a, that looks like a pretty good game. Pretty intense game. But like, I'm such a scrub, like, um, the, the more recent classics, such as like Breath of the Wild. I've seen someone play Breath of the Wild. I've seen someone play, um, Doom. Um, which I consider a modern classic. I haven't played them myself. It's just not enough time, you know? And then when you get really deep in the weeds with RA, you get lost in the RA sets and shit. And it's like, oh, I've got like 300 games on my Steam. It's like, oh, damn. Well, I hope that you had fun with Doom. I own Breath of the Wild, have years never got past an hour of game really I I mean I can see how someone just might not get into it like maybe um, maybe if it had like the guidance or the, the framework of an RA set behind it but yeah I could see why some people like just don't get it or don't like it I mean there are people out there that don't like Skyrim I think those people are clinically insane. Skyrim's, I reckon Skyrim's got to be up there for like top five games for me all time. All time. Unquestionably. Shit changed my perspective on things. Oof. This time will be the 20th, only another 15 more times. I'm definitely saving. I'm definitely saving. Because this is getting crazy. Guessing it's uh, opposite time, you being in, the, in America land, so it must be uh, about 1:30 p.m. your time. That's pretty cool. You've been enjoying your um, your Friday. Yeah, you've been enjoying your Friday. For me, it is Saturday. Ten times. Be
Imagine like trying to wreck someone's playthrough by saying, oh, you gotta go on a date with Barrett. It's kind of fucked up. It's a good thing that I made saves during my, um, my playthrough and staggered them out. You really have to with some of these big sets. If you, if you don't, you're in for a world of pain. Five more times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times five times three. Should be 105. 105 affection points. Because we've got backups of our um, memory cards, we can just save. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So that we don't get messed up. She'll save right there. Oh, <laughs> that particular save, it reminded me of, um, what's his name? Circle something? Um, <clears throat> he was the guy that, um, got Barrett and, uh, Cloud to level 99 before leaving the reactor. Absolute mad lad. And I think his rival was called Dick Tree. That's right. But, um, that, that whole saga, you can look it up on YouTube. But, um, to me, that was like, um, what that told me was if you, if you got something big going, keep it quiet, unless you're about to do it. Or if you're going to announce it, keep at it. So Dig Tree got lazy, but um, then um, Circle something, he completed the challenge that Dig Tree announced. So, pretty interesting stuff. Um, sorry, I need to go all the way up. Then Cave of the Gear again, which I'm going to have to inflict upon everyone, but... Hmm. I'll try and do it as fast as possible. I'm just gonna speed around this. Standing on the table, because you're an old man. My apparatus. Yeah. Get in there. The robot Shinji. And then we have to get back to the big bonfire. I, no, the um, the inn. Shildra. And also, what's that? Not that I'm looking to collect. But the uh, the uh, Turtles Paradise uh, flyers. I'm not looking really to do anything other than get this Chivo, but I got distracted before. That's not going to happen this time. I hope. Hey, boom. Come on. Yeah. 
Yeah, uh, was unlocked. Yeah, Nike. All right. <clears throat> this is just gonna be fast forward. I mean, I like this sequence, but time is of the essence. It's now like 20 to 2 a.m. where I am, so I kind of want to just, you know, get the cheaper going, you know. If I could walk away with two Chivos tonight, that'd be pretty good. Uskedaddle. Hey. Oh, Uskedaddle. Um, just for you. I will show you what happened earlier today. Just let me get through some of this. <laughs> Achivo. So, um... That, that's my mispronunciation. So, Chivo, C-H-E-E-V-O, that's like the colloquialism for achievement, retro achievement. So, um, I'm cleaning up my FF7 badge. I've got 93 of 98, but I want to show you that I, I, uh, I did something earlier today. So, let me just put that here. Okay, let's get the thing set up. Where is it? <clears throat> Where is it? Okay, I'm fine, you Okay, it's all set up. Okay, so this one, this one, this one felt good. Uskedaddle. Check this out. Boop. You don't deserve it. I'd make the screen a little bit bigger, but oh, if jump. I do, it chops off some Did of you? the um the top bit. GG no ring. Let me live! Let me live! Stop impeding me with these HP sapping enemies. Oh yeah, awesome. Like, they, they spawn right on top. Hell yeah. Suck my dick. Yeah. Awesome. Full magic. Here we go, boy. About this time, I was getting very stressed. I mean, look at it. You feel, the tension. you feel the tension in the air? 
when the remake came out, I watched Twitch and asked why they changed Eri's name and asked why she didn't die in it. Everyone was like, spoiler? Yeah, exactly. Um, um, true, true. Um, I'm not actually sure. Like, I watched my friend um, play the remake in Japan, and I can't remember if Aerith um, is alive. Um, I don't think it would make sense for her to. The thing is, with the Final Fantasy VII remake, they're making it ep um, episodic. Um, as far as I know, they're trying to make three. And at the end of the first um, Final Fantasy VII remake, let, let's just call it episode one, of the remake, um, you f at the time that you finish, you exit Midgar. So I mean, like exiting Midgar, like there's there's so much game, there's so much game left. So um, yeah, like it's it's nowhere near the point where, like, at the end of disc one, I believe, is you know where that happens in the the original or the one I'm currently playing. But in the remake, it could only possibly happen in episode two, which is still years away. So, yeah. And I think what they did recently was they released a DLC for the remake, which had Yuffie in it. And I'm like, guys, you haven't even left Midgar yet. Like, they're, they're so eager to get the fucking fanboy money. So eager, they're frothing for it. That's like, calm down, boys. Calm down, boys. Um, oh, and also, um, Square Enix's, uh, CEO is stepping down. I'm not sure if he, he's stepping down or if he's being gently pushed out the door, but he's been replaced by someone that's more knowledgeable in the crypto, um, sphere, apparently. Um, which basically just tells me Square's like a dead company. Like, they sold all the Western IPs that they acquired because they wanted to get into the, um, NFT crypto space and I just thought oh my god of all the blunders they could have made they, they've made multiple all at once I don't think there's any coming back for Square Enix hey don't tell me who won World War 2 that was spoiler for me exactly right yes so what we just finished doing I, I think I mentioned it before I'll say it again there's like a dialogue loop where you can get affection points for Barrett. Um, the affection point system um, is solely designed to set up a date between four people. Um, Tifa, Aerith, Yuffie or Barrett. I think, yeah, like when it, come to, when it comes to the remake specifically, I think there are a lot of, like, Zoomers coming into it, um, like, absolutely raw. Like, they have no idea. Um, even though I think, um, Final Fantasy VII has such a huge audience anyway, it's, it's, it's like as, um, ubiquitous as, like, um, Snape kills Dumbledore. Like, ev everyone knows this shit. But, um, there are some Zoomers out there that, that don't know. Which is, it is mind-blowing, but, you know. And also, um, what's his name? Um, Nojima. The guy that's in control of the, the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Um, he has said that he may not follow exactly the plot of Final Fantasy VII. He might be trying to change it a little bit. He's the guy that was, um, in charge of Kingdom Hearts. So, um, yeah. Look, in my opinion, like... The remake was not for me anyway, so I, I didn't give a fuck, but... There are a lot of people out there that, like, swear by the remake and they love it to death and rah rah rah. I'm like, okay. Okay. But for me... Nah. Final Fantasy VII Original 1997 PlayStation, let's go. That is all that exists for me. That's right. We gotta, gotta fast forward this shit. Blah, 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 blah. Sorry, I'm I, I went through some of this before. But uh 
Yeah. Up until I fucked up and died. <laughs> And uh, Red 13's like, yeah, my, my dad's a piece of shit. It's like, you don't know your dad's a piece of shit. He's like, yeah, nah, nah, for real, so my dad's a like, huge, huge piece of shit. And like, Bung and Hagen's like, oh wow, you didn't know? Know what? Okay, come to the cave. Come to the cave. But now I have to play through the fucking cave of the gear again. Do not want. Let's, uh, let's exchange, um, Tifa, yeah. And Naki. And Tifa's manipulate, all right. All right. All good. Let's just get this over with, again. So I've already done this once before. Oh, and by the way, Kailuya, I have such a lovely time uploading Final Fantasy VII to YouTube. I have such a lovely time. Of the, um, I want to say 220-ish episodes that I've uploaded, I would have put in about 250 counter, uh, content ID counter claims. Because there's some jackass that keeps claiming Square Enix music. Like it's a content ID bot gone rogue. It's 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 so disgusting. Like remember that um in the Discord I shared um oh I got a strike for having the PlayStation 1 splash music. It was it was claimed by a Nigerian rapper. I'm just like this should get wild, man. Um, let's just avoid all the fighting. Uh, nope. Go into this one. Oh, no, wait. Is it this one? Damn it. No, it's the other one. I made a mistake. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Now I gotta heal everyone. Um, boop. It's you. Bonk. There we go. Ho ho ho. Everyone died. Ho 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 ho. It was funny. I killed many. Ho ho ho. Um, this is missable in the game. You can't go back to the cave of the game after you've been in. Oh, oops. Let's not die. Let's just not die. Be bad if I died. Oh, that was that was from running into the the wall from the slick. Ah, I'll show you what I mean. Um, this bit here, if you I guess run into it, the wall, then you get damaged. Interesting. Run away. Shouldn't bother with this, I know. It's just not in my nature to leave Treasury. But I, I gotta leave it behind. I gotta leave it behind. Just get out of here. Uh, gotta heal up again.
Is it the middle one? I, I don't think it is actually. I think it's this one. We do have to, yeah. Fight this thing. Doesn't have anything nice to steal, so. Just need to be a bit wary of it. Because it can do something nasty like that. There we go. Dead. Um. Cure. Lovely. That's right, we're gonna go to another one. It's always so funny to name your characters they ruin. Yep. Yep. I, whenever I play Final Fantasy VII, I always name, you know, Red Thirteen Namaki always. Yep. But some people are smarter than me, and they instead name them things like, um, Heart Dick. Or Ball Bag. And I wish I had the courage. Game Cloud. The Meteor Rain looks so sexy. Definitely the best, uh, one of the best limit breaks. Apart from Omni Slash. This is such a godlike game, it's just like. I had my fill of this game. We did, uh, how many streams of this? 15 streams. Like. It was, it was, it was time. In Among Us, I name my tune a color name and then pick a different color, yeah? Like a, a white character and you name them pink or something. Yeah. Classic misdirection. There's, um, a, a prank that I, um... I think it was a prank picture. Like explaining what to, how to execute a prank. It's like okay, you get three um, piglets, and you put on you know their rump numbers, one, three, four, and then you let them loose, and then people are gonna go, oh shit, where's number two? And so they're looking around for number two. <laughs> oh jeez. Vote blew off. Blew the person or blew the exactly. <laughs> and and while they're trying to determine that, like, in Among Us, like, there's only a set amount of time to decide, isn't there? So, yeah. It's a valid tactic. It's a valid tactic. I'm just gonna burn through my items, I think. The ultimate goal is just to get this done. Booty Warrior. Beautiful face. Okay, so what we're we gonna do here? We're gonna be doing do that. Fire. He loves the fire. Big shot. I don't really know if the um, the flames taking like uh, possession of Cloud or wh whoever. I don't think it really matters. Like he can still be killed normally, so yeah. just keep spamming Beta. And fire too. Because he doesn't like fire too. Yeah, yeah. Loves it. Q2 just to bring everyone up to speed. Yep. Love it. Boom. 
later. He should be pretty close now, actually. There we go. Get out of here. Got something to show you. Takes out the baby dick. Yeah. Let's run to Seto. Dun, 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 dun. Died. It was you the whole time. Deadass. Oh, I'm stoned. So much exposition at uh, Cosmo Canyon. Of course, it's a very important um, point of the game because you you get a lot like uh, a lot clearer picture of like what's going on. Oh, Daddy, Daddy's tears. Oh no, Daddy, drink Daddy's tears. Oh, my son. But when you think about it, like, isn't that horrific? He's still fucking alive after like, what, 50 years? Of being, like, in stone? Imagine just sitting there for 50 years. Not being able to fucking move. Um... I shall take... Oh, this time I'm going to make sure... Okay, definitely I'm taking Eris. Because she has the, um... She has the level 3 limit breaks as well. I forgot about that. See, I'll, I'll show you my bad bitch. Yeah, baby. Bad bitch. Bad bitch. Uh, that's right here. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Wait for me, I'm coming too. If you insist. Come back when you need my knowledge. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. 